Hi guys, uh, welcome to Reboot. Uh, just to give you a bit of a background, this is our, our main workshop where everyone starts uh, any of their work. So it could be our trainees or our volunteers um, or our support volunteers, school work placements or college work placements. Um, so currently at the moment we've got about 35, 40 volunteers on our books and it's about a 50-50 split between volunteers that are coming along to maybe offer a bit of help to us driving the vans on our board of management, or it could be supported by some volunteers, whether they've come with either got uh, hidden disabilities or physical disabilities. Uh, so these guys and girls will come along to hopefully gain a bit of experience, learn a little bit about IT. Uh, there's no real requirement uh, to know anything about IT. Uh, you can come along and have a go. Uh, the key area is over here, uh, where the guys are working, and that's very much focused on the recycling. Uh, so that's taking a system or a device, whatever it may be, and systematically taking it apart and separating that with the parts. So out of those volunteers that come along, there's probably, a, again, a, probably about 50% of them will be technically working in this area uh, at the back there as well. We then have trainees under the Kickstart and Community Job Scotland programs. Um, at the moment we've got seven. Uh, we had eight. One successfully went on to sustainable employment elsewhere, which is the outcome we're looking for with our trainees when they come to us. Um, the trainees were involved in two different roles. We have technical roles and we have warehouse roles. So the warehouse guys and girls, we're doing the sort of stuff that the guys down here are doing, um, uh, basically processing the hard to get into its place. The technical roles, a set up next door and they'll do more of the geeky stuff if you wish. Uh, school work experience and college work experience also come along and again these guys are probably looking for a little bit more of their season uh, to develop their skills. Cool. Okay so we've got some of our trainees here they're just working on uh, this was a business design that just came in the guys are sorting out you can see the kind of mess they're dealing with uh, because Obviously when people are getting rid of their waste, they're not necessarily going to make it neat and tidy. So the guys will be sitting there, they'll be getting everything into categories, counting the keyboards, counting the mice, separating out tile supplies, and getting this ready to be booked into our asset box. So when they've got it all organised, they'll move it over to the other side of the room where it then gets processed into our asset box. So it's a bit of a time consuming, painful job, but it's a job we need to do in order to be able to obviously manage everything coming in. Um, it's not taking them that long. Uh, the guys will be done this in probably about 10 minutes, ready to start processing it. Okay, so th this is the, the key recycling area. We've got more guys at the back doing the same jobs. What the guys basically will do is take one item, uh, it's either too old for reuse or it's faulty, it's no longer working. They'll take that item, they'll take it to the bench, they'll separate it using screwdrivers and snips and then they'll put it in the various boxes you see down here and down here. So everything will be separated, circuit boards, metal, cables, processors, etc, plastic. And when it's all cleared, we will get another one and they'll do it again. So this is key to everything that we do. We're a computer recycling and reuse social enterprise. One of the key things we need to make sure is that we're doing all the recycling. It's also the heart of what we do. So every single person who comes to Reboot starts on the recycling bench, they get to see all the operations moving around and they get to get a bit of an experience and also learn about IT by reversing. So if, as much as you can build a computer system, these guys are taking them apart the other way but they need to know what the parts are as they're separate them out. So they learn quite a bit of tech without even knowing it. So what we've got here guys is uh, what you saw earlier there with the trainees, um, uh, sorting out that IT stuff, it's the same up here, uh, it's getting organised and sorted and then either Mike our supervisor or some of the other trainees will support us in booking that into an asset log. At the point where it's been booked in they can the can the drives and they can sanitise them and then they can make a decision on what's going to go on with it. So it'll sit in this area here will then decide, is it reusable or is it recyclable? If it's recyclable, it goes over here, and our team deal with it. If it's reusable, it goes into a separate workshop where we can actually start looking at reuse. 